Hey guys, it's Ira, also known as Treasure Move, and today I've decided to give you a little treat. I am going to. That music's loud, I'm sorry. Um, I decided to treat you all to my collection. This is not all of it. Um, so, this will just go through them. You know, some of them have sentimental meanings behind them, so I'll explain those. And right, So, we'll start at the bottom tier and work up on And we have Shop All. Keep it an arrow. Keep an arrow actually were a birthday present a million years ago. Um, hold on, I'm gonna turn that down. Okay. Next is, um, Starman. I got him at a fair. I call him Starman. I don't, I don't think he's the real Starman, but and he actually came with a hat. Um, I got him along with Misty. Between the two of them, it was $40, which was not bad. Shop World is 30 if you're wondering. Um, this is just a random full on the uh, Phantom Wings mold. I call her Shinko de Mayo. I don't know why. <laughs> um, I just thought Shinko take Pony Shinko. Yeah. Bad pun. Um, Chili. Chili was actually. Um, wait, no. Shinko was actually a present from a friend of mine. Who used to collect briars and she didn't anymore. She was just like here. So, um, yeah. Then we have Chili. He was a progress report pony. Like this year when I got good grades, I got horses as rewards. So, um, Banjo, who was also um, a report card progress report pony. I'll just call him a grade pony. Um, and then we have Black Gold. Black Gold is, he's wearing a crummy little halter that I made for him. Um, <laughs> but, um, he actually, I actually got him because I finally got my driver's permit, so. He's very special. And then we have Shadow Fax, who is on the, uh, it actually matches that. Um, but I call him Shadow Fax. He is, um, he was the first traditional I bought on my own, and he was $75 with the CD. So, yeah, he was the first traditional I ever bought myself. So, he has some meaning to him. He's actually my second traditional, unless you count Cupid and Arrow. Yeah. Third, technically. Okay, second. You can tell this is a bookshelf. Second, we have all my fo my classic foldies over here. Um, let's see, a couple of them have names: Thunderbolt, uh, Yuma, Brisa. Yeah, that's Brisa. And these three don't really have names. Um, I also have some mini minis. I have. Oh, my Appaloosa, I got at a fair a couple years ago. Um, got Redbird, Rain, Alma, Bizuti. Don't have a name for you, and Desert Rose. One of my favorites. My first Arab, actually. Um, I don't know if you can yeah, go up here. We have Guinevere. I was gonna name Guinevere um, Morgana. I thought of like. I don't know, I just was thinking renaissance kind of names, and um, Morgana would be another bad pun. You have Penelope, Sea Biscuit, War Admiral, oh, Tornado, don't have a name for this guy, but he's really handsome. Don't have a name, Shaitan, Kona, uh, Blackfoot, um, Spirit, Shaman, and... Um, Oh, what's your name? Sirocco. And Shaman is actually wearing a little tack set. And I designed this. I, well, I didn't design it. I made it. But everything he's wearing is real bird feathers, seed beads. Actually, these shields that I'm showing you are a pair of earrings. Um, real leather and glue and Velcro. 
this actually comes off and it can be put on the other horses. And you can see I have some more mini winnies. Then we go up here. Ooh, this computer's heavy. No, no, no. Hold on, my screen is one more. Um, we have Secretariat, and I don't really like the story behind him, why I got him. Um, I actually got him because I went to a guidance counselor because my friend was gonna kill herself. So my parents were really proud of me for doing that and got me Secretariat. I just don't think about the reason I got him. Um, hold on. I think I'll just bring the traditionals over here. Um, this is four. Hold on, I hate this song. Four. I call him Four. Um, he's actually, his full name is, or nickname rather, is Four Buck Bay. He's a family Arab foal. And the reason I call him Four is because I got him in a thrift shop for exactly four dollars. Four Buck Bay. Um, I'm not sure, but I think he might be a chalky, because I, I don't know. I'm really bad at the whole chalky thing, but, um, Obviously, he's pretty old. And his seams are really bad, which is kind of chalky. Kind of, you know. Yeah. And his feet look really weird. They have like that pulling and scratching. So, I don't know. Maybe he's a chalky. Maybe not. I have my two dogs. And there's actually a funny story behind these two. I named them Pickles and Domino. Pickles, Domino. Um, I got these two for about $10 in a set, which was really funny because at the time of the set, I had an English setter and a lab. I still have the lab. Unfortunately, the English setter passed away a year ago. But this is kind of how I remember her. This is a little English setter, and it actually looks quite a bit like her. If I ever get another one, I'll customize it to look exactly like how she did. Um, let's see, oh gosh. Um, you can see I have my, I have Grey Sparrow of the Princess of Arabia set. Obviously she doesn't have her tack, I put that away because I've heard horror stories um, about Briar Tack. That's just right there. Um, this was my Pay It Forward from I forgot who's, who it was, but somebody paid, did a PIF for me. I still have the doll, which kind of looks ridiculous, but, yeah. I'm more interested in the horses anyway. Um, let's see. Oh, Maddie, you the next. Okay. It's really tight space over here, so I'm, like, really terrified to put these guys down and pick them up and whatnot. This is Madison Avenue. She was also a report card grade, oh, I'll call her grade pony. I don't know if I said that before. Um, she had actually been at my local Agway for like three years. And I just saw her, I was like, you know what? She looks really pretty and she, she hasn't been picked up by anybody else. I'll get her. And I'm glad I did because she's really pretty. She is gorgeous. Okay. My first Huck Bay. This is not Cracker Prince. And he doesn't have his tack on either because I heard a horror story about the bleeding. And yeah. Um, this guy was a Christmas present, obviously. Um, so. Yeah, he's really beautiful. Like, I love these horses. Okay, this video is about to run out of time, so I'm just gonna go to a second one and show you my. Sorry, I'm out of stable mates and some of my other animals. So, there's part two.